I want whatever drugs I'm not you interested in going to the hospital and dying because of you. Back up. I'm done. Can you please get what you're getting so I can finish as grocery shopping? As soon as you back up. <laughs> might do you some good to go do some other shopping and maybe by the time you get back here, you'll have plenty of room. Back up. I need security. We're, we're just standing here. We're trying to get through the aisle. She won't let us through. I'm not, look, there's a six foot law and they're trying to get within my six foot range and I'm not going to let them do it till I'm done I selecting what I want to select. Them. You can't let them buy? No, I can't because they get within my six foot when they go by. No, I can't. They can either back up or they can go do some other shopping and come back when I'm done. A local grocery store, this woman will not let others pass her in an aisle. This is you ain't doing nothing but confronting me, all right? You're the aggressor here, not me. We were literally just trying to go down the aisle. Like I said, there's a six foot law. You ain't literally trying to do nothing but make me sit and go to the hospital. Ma'am, what? If you want everybody to stay away from you, that's fine. Okay. That's I didn't no cuss. Yes, you did. Okay, I'll yeah. lay it on my cuss. I don't have freedom of speech around here. Sweetheart, it's obviously polite, okay? Yeah, they're going to kill me, and you think that's polite? They're not going to kill you. If they got some kind of COVID, that's beautiful. Sweetie, sweetie, why aren't you wearing a mask if you're so worried? Because I've been vaccinated, but it's irrelevant because the COVID mutated. Right, right. So right. I could still get it. Sorry. I just want people to back up. Well, sweetheart, don't cuss them and be polite and let them shop. Don't stand in the middle of the aisle, you know? When I'm done selecting what I want to select, they can move over for other customers can get back. This is not six feet. You need to move over for other customers can get back. Woman, you want to go to jail today? Well, come back, sweetheart. You want to go to jail today? Excuse me. Go ahead. You want to go to jail today? You, you tap me and hurt one more time and you're going to jail. Okay? You're the one that grabbed a hold of my car. I moved you. your cart like I asked you to move. Now, will you please get out of the middle of the aisle? You're fired. You don't know who you're dealing with. I'm going to get my boss right now. You're fired. And it is absolute madness. It's not just her attitude. It's not just the wait in line because I'm going to do my thing now. It is not even the entitlement. Or maybe it is all those things. But it's also the fact that she just simply would not move over. She wanted to continue escalating this situation over and over and over again. Now, we have seen the crazies that have come out and gone to these stores. It happens every single day, and I feel bad for the workers because they should not have to deal with this sort of nonsense. In this situation, you get someone that works there, or you report what happened and just go to another aisle because me personally, I don't ever want to mess with these people ever because you have no idea what they're up to.